Eight scrambled eggs, grits, two cups cooked, and tilapia. I always get club sandwich number one on white toast, and uh, I get a side of fries with it, and I get a, a big tub of ranch dressing on the side to dip both the fries and the club sandwich in. Uh, where days I don't train, uh, I'll have just plain 30 egg whites and one cup of cooked grits. Los huevitos con frijoles, jamón, un cafecito. My breakfast is nibbles. I tend to eat little tiny bits throughout the day. We're at Ray's in Santa Monica. The cliche that everybody knows about LA is that it's like a movie town, or you know, everybody's coming here to do something or be someone. A lot of that happens over breakfast. It fuels everything that you do at the start of the day. I think the thing with breakfast and the sort of short order cook format is that it's tailor-made for customization. People coming in and saying what they want, what they don't want, how they want it done, and what they want on the side. It's my friend. It's part of, it's part of, it's part of our work. Este, comer rápido. No nos da ni siquiera 10 minutos y andamos corriendo de volada porque hay que trabajar en un lado, hay que trabajar en otro y cubrir todos. El desayuno es importante para transmitir más alegría, más energía. We have the devotee to cook the breakfast at 7:30 and then they go to work. So we can do like a meditation, we can study, and we can teach the people a really simple life. Yeah. You all set to order? Yep. All right. I have people that come in that are hangry, and then by the end of the meal, they're a completely different person. I guess their blood sugar has leveled out. I get apologies sometimes, like, I'm sorry, I was so hungry, I needed breakfast. There's definitely a lot of people who come in here that you can tell it's been like a rough night and they just need something to get them going. You know, a couple of fried eggs and some bacon. It could bring you back to life or just make sure that you don't literally die. <laughs>